Now we'll send it out to Alex, who is the one outside. I don't generally get to say that, Alex. Yeah, and we've got May Gray going. I, I don't like this. That 95 number is hard to imagine right now. All right, well, so time to ask the auto man our question this morning. Are extended warranties actually worth it? Brian Bowersock from West Escondido Auto here with us again. Good, Good morning. Good to see you, my friend. Glad to be here. Okay, so when you buy a car, a lot of people will be offered a warranty. Sometimes they're offered the extended warranty. Good deal, bad deal? It depends. Okay. Um, as Good with, answer. As with, it does, <laughs> right. as with anything. Um, right. Obviously, you can buy extended warranties when you buy a brand new car. You can get an extended warranty with it. Um, a lot of times, those are manufacturer extended. They're, they're pretty good warranties. Um, you can get an extended warranty sometimes when you buy a used car. Some of those are very good warranties. Some of those are not such good warranties. How do you know? It's very hard to tell, and that, that's what we're talking about today. Somebody should really look at it for you, and that's not the salesman that's selling you the car in the extended warranty. Mm -hmm. uh, somebody like ourselves, we often do it for customers, or somebody that's well-adversed in these things, because there's a lot of phrases in these warranties we're looking for. As like, kind, quality is one big phrase that we're often looking for. And As what, like, kind, kind quality. quality. What does and that what mean? that means is your car is used, correct? Yes. Um, breaks down, the engine goes out, let's say, they can replace it with a used engine. They don't have to use new parts or remanufacture or anything like that. Same thing with the transmission. Um, or they have cap rates often. They'll say, engine failure, $2,000. Well, these days there's no place you're going to get an engine replaced for $2,000. Mm. So it leaves you paying money out of your pocket. Um, the better warranties do cover a car bumper to bumper, but that's a famous phrase often to somebody selling an extended warranty. Oh, it covers your bumper to bumper. And then the customer is quite upset when they find out later on that, no, it doesn't, and it's going to cost them out of pocket for several things. So you hear that phrase, then, then what phrases should you hear would you know you're getting bumper to bumper? What are the things that, that are cues well, that this is a good thing? Correct. Well, there, there, that's where you have to read through it. You've got to read through, figure out what does it cover on the car. Mm -hmm. And often, most people don't know. I mean, if you go, right. you're not that familiar with cars, you go, so yeah. somebody like ourselves that reads, so we can say, okay, this is covered, this is covered, these are normal things of failure. It has electronic coverage or fuel system component coverage and things like that, then it's a really good warranty that covers a lot of things bumper to bumper. So let's talk now for a second about some of the, the loopholes that you just mentioned. These are things that are often fall through those loopholes and talk about how much it costs you. Well, a lot of times you'll see an extended warranty that has just like um, major powertrain like engine and transmission only internal and they a lot of things external alternators things are covered uh, one thing we often see uh, fuel modules this is a fuel pump it goes in the tank it's a fuel module um, installed it can run you anywhere 700 to a thousand dollars depending on the make and model you know mm -hmm. tank has to be removed other electronic components EGR valve which is an emissions component mm -hmm. sometimes not not covered on a lot of these warranties um, and then we get down to the simple this is the ignition coil actually mm -hmm. um, which sends a spark to the spark plug to make it simple um, not covered on some warranties also and so that how much is that running you uh, a couple hundred dollars to have Just have a coil replaced straight out of your pocket Correct. So you said there's a few companies that have really good deals though right there are a few, there's first off there's numerous hundreds right. of extended warranties there are a few companies out there have really good ones you're gonna have to research them to mm -hmm. figure out which um, a lot of the manufacturer extended warranties like if you buy a new car or the through GM or Chrysler or Ford those warranties are pretty good we do a lot of GMPP warranties they're really good warranties mm -hmm. um, but there's numerous companies out there that do have good warranties so once again research it Make sure you read the stuff, know what's going on, or have somebody that's well adversed in it, such as ourselves, do it for you. And while you're here, we wanted to talk about another event that's happening this morning that Correct. you guys are sponsoring, and it's a really good benefit for uh, Robert Rosas, who, of course, was unfortunately killed in, in, in action, and, and we've got a motorcycle ride happening. Correct. It's happening up in North County today on Santar Place at the uh, Sheriff's Station. They're, they're putting it on. It's a big ride. It's uh, registration's 8 o'clock, around there, 8 to 9, rides at 9 o'clock. Um, all the donations go to Robert Rose, Rose's children. Um, if you can't make the ride, you can also go online and donate at robertrosamemorial.com or go on to our Facebook, westescondidoauto.com, and go to our Facebook or through um, the San Diego 6 website yeah. and click on that you like West Escondido. We're donating money to this cause. Excellent. It's well, a good, great good cause. Good for you for doing that, and thanks for helping us save money here as well. Thank for you. more information on what Brian just said or to, to get to his page so you can make that donation, you can go to sandiego6.com and click on Hot Topics.